not a good look for me. That's all, Queen. But uh, thank you. You did me a favor as well. Yeah. You kind of look like a Ninja Turtle. You're not that cute. For love, or are you here to just insult I'm, I'm, I'm trying to create a family. Tricky dance moves at the end of my mind. I'm like, oh, wait, okay, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get in tune with your rhythm, queen, because, <laughs> yes, you look phenomenal, but I can't let the appearance be the interference. Yeah. And I'm going to court my wife and that queen. Hey guys, welcome back to Mortal Life. Before I get into this video, I ask that you like, comment, subscribe. Also, smash that notification bell just to be sure you get on my videos as soon as I release them. Let's get right into this. All right, if we can have your name. Uh, my name is Aaron. Aaron, how old yes, are you? Yeah, I'm 29. 29, okay, yes. and what do you do? Uh, I'm a licensed plumber. Okay, very cool. Yes. And now, what do you look for in a woman? Um, I look like I look for a woman that's not promiscuous and um, has a career going for herself. OK. Yes. Now, do you see this here? This says Wally disrespectful and ends up with one of the prettiest. But this man is not disrespectful. He stood on business. Let's let's watch this. Yeah. And now what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, deal breaker being promiscuous. <laughs> Not cleanly, um, don't have a career, nothing really going for yourself. Okay, all right. So we did get a pop balloon. Let's okay. go ahead and go on over there and see what's going on. Yes. All right, if we can have your name and age and why you popped your balloon. Hi, my name is Karma, I'm 24. Okay. Oh, sorry, I'm supposed to say the pop in the balloon property. <laughs> Got you. Um, for me, it just did not work. I didn't feel like I had chemistry or I wasn't fully attracted to you. And I feel like that counts if we are going to be going through a dating show, you know? Yes, the feeling is definitely mutual. Damn! Damn! So, uh, that's okay. Yeah. Thank you. You did me a favor. You know, absolutely. Yeah. I'm glad you have a great Thank day. Thank you, Queen. You too. Okay. Well, <laughs> let's go ahead. And... All right. We got to pop over here. If we can have your name and age. <laughs> yeah. Every time he's shaded, he walks up with a smile, he smiles hard. <laughs> I love it. I love the energy. Age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, my name is Jara. I'm 22. Okay. And why did we end up popping our balloon? Um, the comment you made. Uh, didn't really, I like a more humble person, not someone that responds so defensive-ish. Yeah, that's really it. Hey, uh, I, I didn't really necessarily like that's how you fine. Responded. Hey, I could just yeah. all I can do is be honest. I mean, you know, yeah, be honest. I be came authentic over here self. To, that's okay. To, to, to find a match, sure. that one match, and that's sure. all, I mean, Queen. A hundred percent. Yes, yeah. yeah, sure. And I was. Uh, you see, he wasn't disrespectful. He spoke his mind. That's why he's there. He's there to find a match. It wasn't matching. She didn't like him. He said you did me a favor. He didn't disrespect to say you ugly oh, yeah. ass. Um, she's someone that's your type. Um. She all right, you know. You're mm -hmm. not really my type. I don't mean to be disrespectful, no, disrespect you know. Me. But if I see you in public, I wouldn't reach out totally to. Totally fine. Yes, ma'am. Thank okay. you. All right. And we did get a pop balloon over here. Your name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Lex, and I'm 23. And I popped my balloon because I feel like you could be a tad bit disrespectful, like how you, like, I don't know, arrogant, a little bit. Yeah. So I didn't see the man be arrogant so far. He's showing confidence. These women see it as arrogance. Maybe it's not the woman for him, right? But we're gonna get into that further. Let's watch this. Yes. Yeah, just that. Well, voice in my opinion is not arrogant. You know, she asked me if she would be a good fit for me. If I like what I see, you know, uh, it's contrary to the truth. So of course. that's all I can do is just state what I see. I don't. That's not a good look for me. That's all, Queen. But uh, thank you. You did me a favor as well. Yeah. Uh Emotional damage. Also, um, what I have to say is it's not what you say. This is what I mean by what I said. It's not what you say. It's how you say it. Yes. You could have rephrased a lot of the things that you have been saying to me as well as the other girls differently. But that's all I have to say. But one thing about me is I'm not going to change who I am of course. to fit somebody else's liking. You know, I'm just going to tell it how it is. 
if you're not it, that's not it. You know, cool. the one that is it, I'm going to let it be known. Okay. You know, for surely, yes. Respectful. Okay. All right. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Brianna, 26. My eyes are, are up here, baby. Are you looking at the tattoos? No, I, I'm, I'm looking at the hair on your arms. You know, women I deal with, they don't have hair on their don't arms. Don't do too much. Hey, I'm just being honest, Don't do queen. too much. You know, I, I don't like that. That's okay. all I was looking at. You trying? It's funny, too. He's looking at the hair on the arms. You trying to say if I'm looking at particular body you just parts, wasn't but looking that's at my not eyes. what it is. That's no, I was, I was looking at the hair out. on your Anyways, arms, Anyways, she asked me the question. Yes. Um... Yeah, I'm in heels and you ain't tall enough. Okay. Don't do too much. Well, though. you're not qualified, baby. All right, that's so that's good. all good. Let's move on. Let's move on. Okay. So <laughs> we do still have three unpop, but she looking like you gonna pop? Okay. Man. Okay. All right. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Jacqueline. I'm 25. I popped because I have hair on my arms. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so she kind of. Put herself out of the competition for no reason, right? But let's see what he says after this. Hey, just because you got hair on your arms, that's okay, though, Queen. You look phenomenal, though. <laughs> Thank you. You know, she ain't Don't fit to my liking. She ain't even fit to my... Hey, excuse me, Queen. I'm, I'm talking to this woman right here. He got game. Oh, uh, well, I could look anyway. I could look anyway. I could look any way I want to. You know? But, yeah, can y'all give her her balloon back, though? Yeah, do you want your balloon back, Queen? Uh, we're not talking to you, sweetheart. Okay. You, you already been, I already let you know. I'm not interested in, you got more hair on your arms than me, baby. But uh, anyway. Okay, so he's saying, get your balloon back, but. Oh, man. Um, I'm not going to get my balloon back. Okay. <laughs> All right, no problem. You see how he's not even phased? You got more hair on your arms than me, baby. You not gonna take your balloon back? Ah, right, okay. It's nothing. So we do still have uh, two balloons. Yes. Do we still have two balloons? No. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. I saw you hesitate. That's why I had to ask. So if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Kayla. I'm 23. Um, originally I was not gonna pop my balloon because I know a lot of them popped it because he was being, I guess, arrogant. Mm -hmm. But to me, I like my man that's not going to sit in every girl's face and, you know, complimenting them, you know? Mm -hmm. So I didn't find that offensive to me. But when they started, that what was going on, I'm very, like, I'm, I don't want to say I'm argumentative. You know what's happening? The women are following other women. When women are in packs, right, they kind of favor each other. It's like a natural sisterhood. So they're looking at what he's saying to other women. They're feeling some kind of way. They're feeling like he's disrespectful, but he's not. All he's doing is standing on business, speaking his mind. He didn't call anyone one B word. He talked about hair on arms. He didn't say, oh, you ugly. You look crazy. Nothing like that. He's speaking calmly, respectfully. All he's doing is speaking up. But I don't want my man to argue back with me because then I feel like it's going to always be a problem. That was the only reason why I popped my balloon because I was just like, dang. Um, but then with me, you kind of got a little bit catty with me. You a little sassy just a little bit. And since you want to come at everybody over here, I'm going to get at you too. You kind of look like a Ninja Turtle. You're not that cute. You see what she just did? She's running with the pack. Because you get on everybody over here, I got to get at you too. What does those other women have to do with you? It's supposed to be all of you are competing for, for one guy. But they're running in packs. You, you need to relax. Uh, you stocky as hell. And I was trying to be respectful, okay. but yeah. like you was, you was really coming out. Like I didn't, I didn't like it. I'm from the South and I can okay. handle like a lot of criticism and stuff like yeah. that. But the way you was coming, you just ain't like you got it all like that. And I guarantee you probably got a roommate at home and it's just not giving anymore. Yeah. Well, let me say this, Queen. I'm a licensed plumber. So, I live, and I, I do real estate I live and property management. I live downtown. So what you I live downtown. I stay by myself, Queen. You know, and you're not even qualified to be even you dealing say with me. You everybody not qualified. To, you definitely not. You know, if anything, it was one of these two. I wasn't even looking your way. You and ain't the one my that type. you wanted, Pop If I seen, I, that's fine. So that, what? That is, that's totally fine. Okay. But one thing about me, I could pull a hundred thousand on the bank. Can you do the same? Get this yeah, you can't do that. that. You can't do that, though, baby. Yeah, in let's a real move way. You can't move do move that, though, Queen. All right, if we can have your name and age. Hi, I'm Esther. I'm 23. 
Okay. And Esther, uh, you still have your balloon unpopped. Why so? Are you done? Oh, yeah, I'm done with the rest of that. Okay. You know. Okay, now we can talk, right? In a real way. Okay. <laughs> what do you look for? I look what are for you looking for? A, a woman like I... So what he said in the beginning, he's looking for a woman that's not out there and in the streets and a woman he can deal with. Now, this is the thing. I don't know why the clip is stopped, but he actually chose her. He chose her and they went out together. He hung out with her. He was actually very happy. That was one of the best parts. I would love to show it. Oh, yeah. I'm down with the rest of that. Okay. You know. Okay. Now we can talk, right? In a real way. Okay. What do you look for? I look what for are you looking for? A, a woman, like I said, that's not going to be promiscuous, a woman that's going to be consistent, a woman that has a career and things going for herself, because I had the same thing going for myself. Uh, I don't need a woman to uh, give me her money um, or anything. I'm just looking for devotion and some loyalty, that's all, and some honesty. Do you believe in God? Oh, certainly. Yes, ma'am. But we can get to that at a later date and time, you we know, can. if you choose to... Uh, leave here with me okay do you know the bible says that love is kind yes certainly for love or are you here to just insult i'm, I'm, I'm trying to create a family you know okay. that's what i aspire to do you're good sure we're good oh okay all right any questions for her no not at all oh do you have any kids no i don't do you want kids i do you how old gonna are give you me again? Son? huh how old are you i'm 29 how old are you 23 okay is that okay well, that's perfectly fine okay. You know, okay. we might as well get up out of here right now. All right, well, let me let, let's yeah. step on over here. Let's step on. Step that way real quick for me. Step that okay. way. Okay. <laughs> All right. So it seems like there's a little vibe here. So is it going to be a yes for you for him? God says save souls. So, yeah. Oh, and is it a yes for you it's for her? It's going to be a hell yes for okay, me. Okay, we yeah, got a man. Right. She chose him. And then after the date, he felt a certain way. He got out with her. He went out with her. He seen how she was. Maybe he's seen a little too much because they were vibing. Uh, this next clip they were vibing but what happened was he saw just a little too much that he didn't like let's get right into it and um as y'all remember i stated several times on the show being promiscuous is one of the main things that i did not like he did and she was manifesting signs of promiscuity how was she doing that well after the show okay so let me tell y'all um, we hit it off well. The conversation was very pleasant. It was phenomenal. I must say, you know, when we matched and she did her little tricky dance moves at the end, in my mind, I'm like, oh, wait, okay, baby, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get in tune with your rhythm, queen, because, <laughs> yes, you look phenomenal, but I can't let the appearance be the interference. Right, right. I need to know if your inner beauty matches your physical features because if it doesn't you know we're not gonna yeah because the, the funny thing she was the most beautiful one up there right and after that she kind of said right away i want you he said i want you too he was excited she was dancing he vibed with her and then he took he took her said we can be right now i'm going to date right now gonna align we're, we're just gonna be um manifesting what lust we're gonna be lusting over one another and that's not what i'm looking for i honestly truly want to find that woman that is going to give me a family that i'm gonna come home um to work to from um and if you are and i feel this way because i know you know what type of man i am i'm big alpha after you meet me Baby, your eyes, you should not have a wandering eye because you met the prize. The winning prize is right in front of your eyes. And if you can't see that, you are not for me, baby. And if she ain't acting like that, fellas, y'all got to disqualify him, man. Stop qualifying the man. Ooh. And I'm not leading with my money, honey. That is the furthest thing from the case. Drizzle. I'm just letting you know. Hey, baby. Hold up. Can I get a drizzle one time? Drizzle. Drizzle. This man ain't playing. Baby, I got it. But if you think Esther was finna get some money up out of me, boy, she wasn't finna get a wooden nickel. One thing about me is I don't treat women. I court them. You know, it's a big difference in a real way. And I'm gonna court my wife and that queen out there somewhere. Baby, if you watching this, hello, my man. I heard that. 
so from what we, we just seen, right? Because he got her. And then he disqualified her like that. That man wasn't up there to kiss no buns, to simp, to make women feel like they're the prize. He let it be known, I'm the prize. And you got to step up to the plate and knock it out the park. Because if you don't, you ain't the one. And this is what more guys need to do. And more guys are starting to do it. Because they realize it's definitely more to life. They're going through anything. That's not that. This is the way. Your passport, bro. Cash for. No. Come.